In today's video of GTA 5 RP, I'm going to be showing you some of the best practices and best ways to make money in DVRP. Let's go, y'all. In the next couple of days, I'm going to be doing a series of videos that shows you a lot of the new stuff that we've added, especially right after devs may have fixed or added something different. I'm going to show you guys some videos on how or, or where they are or how to do it. Some stuff, obviously, I'm going to have to hide, you know, <laughs> like you shouldn't know that stuff off the bat. But things like jobs, etc. I'm going to make it known for you guys to go ahead and access it so you can make the money. You can do what you got to do and focus on your storyline. Hey guys, sorry for interrupting the video, but I wanted to go ahead and put a little shameless plug in here to the DVRP tab. DVRP is now going to be offering a bunch of services to enhance your roleplay experience and you can come over here to the services tab and now you can go ahead and spend some money to be able to um get some stuff in game now this this money is used for dvrp and the expansion of the server whether it might be buying new scripts or buying new stuff it doesn't matter we're going to be using that for the server and in here you can go ahead and press view and you can see what for example you'll be able to get whenever you um put this set of money we when you go ahead and you make a purchase just go ahead and take a screenshot of your um your receipt or of the i guess it's the receipt right you take a screenshot of the receipt create a ticket and put it in there and an admin or a dev will be able to give you or send you or show you whatever it might be for you to uh that you just purchase etc there's going to be different things on here for you guys to access so go ahead look through see what you like and ignore what you don't like and um we really appreciate all the love and all support from everybody so anyways i'm done y'all i'm done yapping now so see you guys in the video let's get back to the video what's going on guys welcome back to the channel and welcome back to some more dvrp in this video i'm gonna do something more like a tutorial i just wanted to show you guys a couple of things that it come it came across to me recently that a lot of players in dvrp don't really know of the new stuff that we have added into the server okay so i decided that i'm going to kind of explore with y'all one and two um i'm also going to give you guys a couple of tips with certain stuff that uh that we didn't necessarily make clear so if you guys like this video hit that like button subscribe turn on the notifications so you know whenever i post and uh let's get into this one making money in dvrp is relatively easy we made it we made it so that you guys can have tons on tons of options so that you can make your money and do everything but i also want to show you a trick and when you're spending your money you're going to get a car the biggest thing when you're getting a car first of all pdm right now we haven't been able to fix this invisible wall never mind yeah we haven't been able to fix this invisible wall really so you usually have to come down here maybe through these these little these little uh these yellow things here or maybe some spot around here you can walk straight through it there and then walk into the door that's usually the trick to how to get through it but i'm going to show you guys uh kind of how for for lack of a better term how to spend your money and what stuff to get now everything in here is out of stock unfortunately i don't understand why this dealership is always out of stock but i'm gonna spend a little bit of their money real quick use my admin powers just spend a little just a, a tad bit of their money okay so we're gonna go ahead just so that i myself can get a car god damn they ain't got no money all right let's deposit let's deposit some money into their account i'm gonna give them some of my money here let's deposit 150k into their account that's why they they, they broke because they ain't got no money and let's look for something that we can go ahead and buy these are the orders here um let's let's put something in stock here um what kind of vehicle do i want hmm you guys can't do this this is something that admins can do um where we could help the dealership out a little bit but i'm gonna just go ahead and i gave them a little bit of money so that they can start doing more stuff let's get let's get a bmw just like steve do they have that m5 in here uh i don't know 
let's see uh bmw all right somehow not popping up uh five no uh all categories let's just let's just do import category uh where is it where are the imports where are the imports import import, import. there we go and let's see here this is all the imports they got that's tragic all right let's get this car right here i love this car so we're gonna get one so we ordered myself a bmw a 2021 bmw m3 g80 that's my dream car might as well go ahead and get it right so we ordered that car and uh we're gonna go ahead and buy it for ourselves and i'm gonna show you guys a couple of the tricks that you need to know when you're buying cars and as soon as you get the car what's the first thing that you should do whenever you you get yourself a car um we're just gonna wait one more minute one more minute for this car to show up in the dealership and then we're gonna go ahead and buy it now in order for this 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 kind of stuff to work you you have to be kind of you have to have the money one and two uh, you gotta have some kind of a knowledge of the script. Um, this, this, uh, the vehicle key script. A lot of people have been having issues with the vehicle key script, and it is really, really easy to get around. Um, you just, you just have to, you know, think about what you would do in real life. Some people, I understand that some people don't necessarily do this. As soon as they they get a key from the, they, they get their keys from the dealership, they go right ahead and um, and get the car or whatever it might be but it's always best practice whenever you whenever you get a car uh, a key from or you ever get a car from a dealership it's always best practice to go ahead and get yourself a duplicate key just in case just in case your key in particular gets misplaced or your car you know some something happens the key gets broken whatever it might be um it's always best practice for you to go ahead and get a duplicate key. So we're going to go ahead and purchase the car. So let's go ahead and buy this. Um, we're going to pay in full from our straight bank account. So we got ourselves a new BMW. I don't know why it stands like that. That's kind of weird, but it is what it is. So as you guys can see, as soon as I got in the car, um, I'm able to drive it. However, if you look at my inventory, this is not the key to this car, I don't believe. No, this is not the key to this car. The way you could tell that is if you hover over it, you'll see the plate. This is not the key to this car. We got to go get a key. So I'm going to go right over here. I'm going to drive the car directly over to the locksmith. And I am going to go ahead and purchase the key. Or I'm going to go and get a, a duplicate key or replace the key. Whatever it might be. This is the easiest way in the script to be able to have access to your keys all the oh all the time. Sometimes your car might spawn without a plate and you gotta go down to the mechanic shop and get that get that worked out. Man, on my way, bitch. Damn. What y'all got going on, man? So we're gonna go ahead. You have to bring the car when you're going to the locksmith. We're gonna go to the locksmith, we're gonna press this, and I'm gonna change the lock. You could create a duplicate key, but I don't really do that so now we have a key here i could go ahead and use the key turn the engine off lock unlock the car all that kind of stuff so i just turned the, the car on we have all access to the car now boom and you have a key that's the first thing you do so me personally whenever i buy a car i'm gonna take my car directly to the dealership or to the locksmith and create a completely new key so that I have access to the keys going forward. Now you can make duplicates from there if you want to, just in case you know somebody robs you and takes your stuff or whatever it might be. But this is what I would do in this situation. And now since I have the key, I'm gonna go right back over here to the dealership and I am going to go ahead and get my car insured and registered just so when the cops pull me over i i ain't have no issues feel me so let's go ahead and uh, um 
go ahead and get some registration and insure the car and uh that should be easy right there so boom boom all right so now that that's done i'm gonna discuss with you a couple ways that you guys can go ahead and make money in the server there's many jobs right here that you guys can do um the ones that i personally recommend are going to be group six and the deliverer job i've heard from uh many players that they make you uh, a quite decent amount of money so let's go ahead and lock our car you come over here to this little icon here you could press e to start work you could either decide to um change over into your uh your, your clothes or or what might be the case you should have been able to do it i might have to go back in the script and uh and change that up but you could go ahead in here and start the job and basically just follow the instructions on the job it will tell you what to do and what you can't do so i'm gonna go back in the script and enable it so you can get into job flows um i configured it so that it actually puts you in a group six uniform uh, but i also gotta change the uh, i gotta change it for all of the other jobs as well there's a postman job right here across the street right here you could do the postman job which is uh you can come in here if you walk up these stairs right here boom you got this postman job so that other job is supposed to be able to do this i don't know why it's not doing that i gotta change the clothes i'll change the clothes later but for now uh you can go ahead and do that next um there's some few other ones i did this one on stream the other day which i will uh which i will send the link so that you guys can see which is the oil refinery job just go ahead and come down here and you can um be a part of the oil refinery i think there might be an issue with the locks but i'm not 100 percent sure it's always good to go ahead and check that out next thing there's going to be this treasure hunter job right here this allows you to go under the water and look for treasure i've seen from from sieve streams that this can be very 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 useful so make sure you go ahead and take a trip down there um this is another job right here that i recommend um this is the builder job um i'm gonna go ahead and take the trip down there now but i've heard the builder job has been very 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 lucrative for a few people so you might want to go ahead and try it um let me know what y'all think but as i said it's quite easy to make money in the vrp we've made we've given you guys so many options so many options but at the end of this video i'm gonna go ahead i'm gonna try the farmer job oh don't want to crash into any of those i'm gonna go ahead and find the farmer job because um oh my car is already starting to cut up i gotta go get a service but um i'm gonna go ahead and try the farmer job so you guys can kind of see what that job's all about so you can come down here this one right here is the builder job uh and you get to build buildings and stuff i'm also going to show you guys maybe a stream or so later on um right here you could change your clothes on this job i gotta go back to the group six one and i also gotta change the clothes on this one i, I i've never done it i i just I, I don't know why but i've never i've never i haven't gone back into configure the script fully yet but as i said i'll do that probably over the weekend so that you guys can actually look like you know you're on the job and stuff like that sorry about that um so that's the builder job you can go ahead and do that um there is also um i know there is the group six job up here this one not group six the go postal job i've seen a lot of people doing it and i don't know if you want to check out malik's stream he was doing it up just last night on his live stream and then there's the minor job i did this with all of the crew when the vrps first started we went ahead and did this i'll also send you guys a link to that video now we're gonna go ahead and head out to the county actually i'm gonna stop on my camp my mechanic shop first and see what what kind of servicing i can do to my car and then i'm going to uh head out over there and bring you guys back once i do that um let's see what kind of what kind of uh modifications and stuff i can add on to my car to make it so that it doesn't blow up when i'm when i'm on my way up there um 
So let's go ahead and uh, performance. I don't even know if I have many more performance parts. We got to restock. I'll probably do that today, actually. Let's let's go check my vehicle stash. Let's check it and see. Um, let's see what we got in here. So we don't have any performance parts. I do have spark plugs, uh, refresh kit. Okay, so I can do some servicing. Um, oh, we can do custom plates. Let's do let's do a custom plate. Um, I think I think all we could do with this one right now is a servicing. Um, I can't even stance it or anything like that. Um, we're gonna I'm gonna go ahead over to the place, um, AutoZone later. And I'm going to, um, what do you call it? I'm gonna, I'm gonna go to AutoZone later and uh, restock. So we're gonna connect the vehicle here, service. Okay, so everything seems to be good. I don't really need to do anything. Okay. Well, that's fine. That's fine. I ain't gotta do none. These tires are throwing me off, but you know it is what it is. Uh, actually, since since I'm already here might as well and i see some extras extra kit on there so let me see if okay that's just for the front plate cosmetic if i uh let's see if i can get this car a nice little facelift um rear bumper let's fully max it out i think with the the, the the tires being like that might as well right uh we don't need a roll cage grill let's do custom grill uh do i need carbon no i don't right wing uh let's use control and hold shift to look around Uh, I don't really like it like that, to be honest with you. But we're gonna do it for now. Um, custom diffuser. I think that's at the back. Yeah, I don't like that. Take that off. Uh, strut. White body rear bumper. Yeah, I don't really want that either. Let's put some tint on it. So this is if I wanted to do the white body here. The car is black, so it's not like I can see it very well. The sunroof. Let's keep it like that. All right, so we're... Yeah, I don't know. I don't know if I like it like this, to be honest with you. But we're gonna just we're gonna just do it. F it, right? We're gonna just do it for the sake of doing it, and see how it looks at the end of all of this. And y'all get to tell me if y'all like how the car looks or not. Uh, I don't want no diffuser, hydraulics, no left wing. And then that's the white body front. Okay. Um, I don't, I think I'm done. White body front bumper. Yeah, let's keep that. Let's just, let's just keep it consistent throughout. 23,000. I got to pay for this. So let's go ahead and fulfill. All right. Let's see how many parts this is going to take. Work orders. Dolphus Miller review 17 cosmetic parts. All right, let's just use all of the ones that I have here and then we can hit up AutoZone and finish the job later. So I know I have, where's the cosmetic part? Did I not have any cosmetic parts in here? That's tragic. I just did all that for no reason. That's crazy. Anyways, 
we can uh we gonna go restock from AutoZone later. All right, it'll be fine. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. All right. So we're gonna go on over to the farm, and I will bring you guys back once I get there. All right, guys. So we are now getting here. We are at on new farms now. So we're gonna go ahead and try this out. Imagine going to a farm in a BMW, bro. Crazy, right? You gotta be making bank as a farmer. Anyways, so we're gonna just burst through here for a sec. Alright, so let's go ahead and lock our car and hit up the farmer here. Speak to the farmer. Okay, it's not working. Okay, so right now that's something that we're gonna have. All right, so the farm the farm job isn't working right now. That's something we're going to have to fix. But you can come up here. You can do some, you know, some other stuff. I'll show you guys once that is completed. I'll show you guys that once uh once we get everything to be working. But when you come and be the farmer, you can take care of the pig. You can uh, herd all the cattle. I believe there's cattle over there um, that you can you can interact with, etc. Um, I'm going to do a video on that once you guys are, once you guys, um, once I bring you guys back, then, forgot, let me turn the car on. Once, uh, I'm going to I will bring you guys back and I'm going to do the full farmer job once I tell the devs to fix it. Once they fix it, I'm going to run this one back so you guys can, can, uh, can see. But I'm also going to show you guys a few more features, um, like like buying TVs and stuff like that and putting them down. To buy a TV, you got to go up to the grocery store. You can cook yourself and all that stuff, too. Uh, you got to go up to the, gro the, gro the grocery store up here in Polito 026. Buy a TV from there. You can set it up in your house and watch some TV, you know. Just put the link to the YouTube video or whatever it might be that you want to watch um, in the TV. And it should play in the server and it will be synced between all players. However, just remember if you have streamers around you, it's probably not best practice for you to do that because you're going to cost them a little bit of money. Okay. So make sure that whenever you're doing stuff like that, you don't, you don't, you know, mess with uh, any of the streamers, etc. So um, that's going to be basically majority i wouldn't say majority actually let's not say majority that's gonna be a lot of the ways to make money another way to make money is just get hired at one of the uh one of the stores one of the jobs you know there's there's businesses there's all kinds of different um avenues for you to just go on and make some money and um my mechanic shop is hiring i'll be hiring mechanic people that want to work on people's cars obviously everybody can't be a mechanic but at the same time you could be you could work in a restaurant you can go start your own business um right now we're looking for governor we're looking for a governor and a mayor somebody that's going to be able to um work on uh hosting auctions setting up their own businesses setting up all kinds of stuff like that um the dvrp tabex is going to be very 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 important if you guys want to skip some a lot a lot of this grinding and stuff you could go ahead and hit up the tebex we have all of those different things so make sure you guys go ahead and pay attention to those that stuff but that's gonna be it for me for today's video thank you guys for all the love and all the support it's gonna be a short one um starting at next week i'm gonna try more to do some more uh some more full-on rp videos for more than two days a week but today and tomorrow's video is going to be more about showing you guys a little bit more into what's going on with the vrp and uh yeah hope you guys enjoy and uh i'll see you guys in the next one peace y'all all right so another tip that i have so you guys keep track of your keys is that whenever you take your car to a mechanic uh sorry not a mechanic to a garage you can just put your keys in your in your glove box because whenever you get back in the car um, from the garage, so let's go ahead and let's drop our key in here. Just I don't think this is for that car. So let's drop our key in here, right? Restore the vehicle. Boom. We can go ahead, take the vehicle back out, and we got the keys now. 
So we can move the car and we got the keys here. So this is something that you guys can go ahead and do um, just to make sure. Sometimes I forget like like with this one, I forgot my uh, my key was in, in there. So yeah, um, I want to say thank you guys for all the love and all support. Hopefully to see you guys on tonight's live stream and uh, I'll see you guys next time or I'll see you guys for the next rest of the video. I don't even know when I'm going to put this part of the part of this this clip into the video but yeah i'll see you guys then peace y'all